Y'all heard the music. I know y'all heard the music. Like, if you didn't, you need to go ahead and clean your ears. Somebody get her a Q-tip. I'm just playing. Don't use Q-tips. It's not good to put Q-tips in your ear. But you can get one of them drain things. But anyway, this is not that type of hygiene video. It's me, Tina Marie, with Candle News Network. Network. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Make sure your notification bell is on. So each and every time I upload in this thing, you are alerted. So Bath & Body Works said, we're going to go ahead and give you this 20% off. So many of y'all want to complain about not getting coupons. So we're going to go ahead and give you 20% off. So thank you, Bath & Body Works, for giving a 20% off. So everybody can enjoy getting a discount because a lot of people don't don't get the paper coupons and the paper coupons go through like a third party so it's so random who gets those coupons and who doesn't and some people get four or five of those coupons and some of us just get none so it is crazy and it doesn't even go by how much you spend or being on any type of list but they're doing a single week sale today and y'all the only thing i'm looking at is that um blueberry one i think it's blueberry or something like that but that blue one right over there but i think 6.95 is a wah, wah. i don't think that's a good price but some of these little new ones is cute like i mean the hot cocoa and cream i just love this whole new little line right here um i think they're really cute and i don't recommend spending 6.95 but i guess because you get the additional Will you get an additional percent off or do you have to use a barcode? Y'all let me know below because I didn't really look into it because I seen 695 and was like, I don't know about that. But if you don't have to use a barcode and you can use the 20 percent off, then it's a realm of possibility for me. So y'all, I'm feeling this signature cocktail, okay? I love me some sweet whiskey. Y'all already know, so I love that. Bourbon is getting new packaging. What's good? I'm loving it. Okay. And then we have a returner. Okay. Whiskey Reserve. I like that one. Like, I like that one a lot. Like, give it to me. So I cannot wait to get more for Justin. I know I stocked up on it during SAS when it was 75% off, especially at the outlet. They had so much of it. So now knowing that it is coming back, y'all, I'm super excited. Like, put it in a bag. But put it in the bag for a low, low price when they do a men's sale for $5.95. But, yes, I'm very intrigued about all the new packaging. What do y'all think about the new packaging going on, especially for the bourbon um, and them bringing back the whiskey reserve let me know below now my canadian plug bbw loves 50 if you do not check her out check her out she was showing us some new new did you see that that little pup pup was cute cute so definitely i want to get that pup like i don't even got a dog but i'm thinking about it like i'm really thinking about it so yeah i might get that pup prepare me for the real thing if it ever happens but yeah go check her out if you do not check her out so i want to take a moment and talk about the new return policy rundown so i didn't have time to do my return before the new policy went into effect um because y'all know me i don't even like doing returns unless i absolutely have to just due to the fact i ain't even gonna cap i don't want to take the stuff back sometimes clothes and stuff will sit in the back of a closet i will not take something back just because no sit in the back of the closet to go to goodwill ask my mama receipts be on it okay tags on it and i'm just be don't want to do it i just don't be wanting to do it but i had to do this one and it was such a great experience like let me walk y'all through it basically if you don't have the receipt you take your items up to the counter um they'll go ahead they'll get your loyalty information and then they will scan your id um once they scan your id that ups loads in the system and then they track how much returns you have i guess it's like 250 per quarter or something like that y'all let me know if i'm wrong in the comments below but um i think it's 250 per quarter and after you reach that amount you can't do me any more returns but i did my return i uh, got a few items and then they uh gave me the remainder on a merch card and it was very simple easy of course you get the lowest value because you didn't have your receipt and i know me i don't keep up with my receipts especially with bath and body works since i'm there so often so it don't bother me anyway because they're gonna get all their money back plus some anyway um but she told me she said this is a great way so that way we can keep up with theft and keep theft down and i can see that that's a great way to keep theft down because after 250 uh -uh, you can't do anything else this quarter it ain't gonna stop people that want to you know have multiple people come in different people names and stuff but i love the new policy it was nice and easy i have no complaints um and the product for product i didn't try to do and they said you know that has changed as well and it is what it is like 
you know, return things when it's in season or it is what it is. But I want to know what that do when it comes to this candle. Y'all know about the Lulu candles? Let me know in the comments below. My mom actually got this candle as a gift from one of her neighbors. I tried to walk off on it, y'all. I tried to walk off on the wig twice, okay? And she was not having it. She said, put that candle down, girl. But I was like, the aesthetics. It's so aesthetically pleasing to look at. Like, it's giving that modern day aesthetics that everybody is going for now. And I kind of want to do my bathroom in this color now because I seen um, one of my sisters on YouTube do her bathroom like that and gave it a spa look. And I'm like, oh, maybe I want a spa look and change it up. I don't know, but I want a candle like that. That's all I know. So, mom, I mean, what's good? What's tea? You going to go ahead and break that candle off for me? Okay, but I might order some because now I really do want to do a spa thing for my bathroom. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, I want to say big facts. Tebow fan, if you don't check out Tebow fan on IG, check him out. He posted this in his stories over the weekend. Like I told y'all, watch our stories, man. We be being funny sometimes. But he said, bad that body works will repackage stuff. I'm just going to, uh, you know, break it up and put it as one little thing. But watching us get excited over repackages like and that's the big old ceo and all them people just like <laughs> but it be like that sometime it definitely do because if you're a packaging junkie and we already know bath and body works is the king and queen of remixes and i call it remixes because it's repackages so they will do about 20 versions of one candle in a season <laughs> like okay that's a little bit extra but y'all know bath and body works is the queen of the repackage it is what it is so y'all i need y'all to go follow me on ig it's tmr2886 and give a like to grace and christian's most recent video y'all they have almost 10 k views on this little skit like almost 10 k views so please go and support them go and spread it and get this out here we trying to get it to go viral the kids want to go viral they want a viral video so go and support them and help the kids go viral it was so funny to make they over here try to really pay attention but they already know all the words um but we did this in one take we did this in one take but we listened to it a couple times first before we did the take but this was the first take and it came out actually really, really good. So, yeah, give it a one-time love for the kiddos, okay? Now, this is my final thoughts, and I'm going to leave it here, and I'm going to get off here because I got things to do because they're actually putting me to sleep today. I'm having two rounds of MRIs done. The first one's this Monday. The next one's next Monday, so they're going to put me to sleep at 1 o'clock. So, say a little prayer, though. Um, but this is my final thoughts. Don't turn my light on to tell me a MF and N thing. Y'all put the words in there, all right? I can hear it in the dark. I hate when the kids come in my room. Mama, I got to tell you something. The lights is off. You better keep them lights on. Do not turn them lights on. Keep them lights off. You turn them light. You do not need to turn the light on to talk to me. You do not need to turn that light on to talk to me. Keep that light off because my ears, they hear. My eyes, they see. Okay? So <laughs> I just wanted to leave y'all with that little bit of humor. Make sure that you get your coffee mug down below. Click the link. Have your Candle News Network the right way. I love you guys. And DJ, one time for the people that's going to go ahead and give my kids some love on IG. In the front and the back. Play my music.